Okay, so why don't you go ahead and tell us the name of the game? Rattus. Yeah, Rattus of Games. Well, um, uh, uh, Rattus is a game that is uh, uh, very successful uh, uh, worldwide. And uh, uh, this year in Essen will present a new expansion, the second expansion for, uh, uh, for Redis. And uh, it, it really uh, changes uh, the, the, the base game on, uh, on quite a lot of expert, uh, aspects. I'll uh, get to that later. I shall first explain a little bit what the base game uh, was all about. Um, um, you, you see the map of, uh, of Europe and uh, each player has a population of 20 cubes. These are your population cubes. And the goal of the game is to get as many cubes as possible uh, on the board. Um, the player who has uh, the most cubes uh, on the board when the game ends, uh, wins the game. So what you're trying to do uh, during the game is put as many cubes as possible on the board. But uh, uh, we're in the Middle Ages and uh, uh, the Black Death strikes in uh, whole Europe. So during the game, it might be that you have to take uh, cubes away from, uh, from the board. And you have a lot of uh, character cards. There are six, uh, six in the base game. Uh, characters that will uh, help you to get cubes on the board. But they also have a uh, disadvantage because they make you uh, um, uh, weaker. Yeah, the, the, uh, um, it, it will be easier for the, for the Black Death to, uh, to uh, destroy your population when you have gained the help of those, uh, of those characters. So what you basically, basically do uh, during a game is you can take a character card, for example the farmer. Um, that's the first thing you do and you're not obliged to do it, but uh, it's a choice and you can have as many cards as you want to. You can also take cards that other players have in front of them on the table. Um, then you put cubes on the board, uh, you pick one country, and if there's one red token in that country, you add one cube uh, to it. But I have the farmer, and his special ability is to add one cube more, so I can put uh, two cubes in this uh, region. And after that, I uh, may move uh, the... Oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> there, goes my, there goes my population. <laughs> uh, I, I may move, uh, I must move uh, the Black Death Marker. To, uh, uh, to an adjacent country, for example this, the yellow player has two cubes here, there's one red token here. Uh, when there are cubes and red tokens in a region, um, I first have to add one token in a surrounding region, and then the red token will be flipped over. If the yellow player, for example, has the witch in front of him, this token says two plus, so the black death strikes when there are two or more cubes in this region. Well, in this case, that's the case. And those, uh, 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 those icons, uh, the, the Black Death will uh, strike on those icons. So if Yellow has the Witch, for example, he has to take one cube off the board. And that, in short, is, 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 is Redis. Um, it's a very fun and uh, quick and easy to uh, teach and learn uh, game. And um, um, one of the funny things of the game is that in the base game, you have six characters that can help you. And, um, uh, there are quite some interesting combinations between those characters, how they interact uh, with each other. Uh, uh, last year we uh, released uh, an expansion for uh, Redis, and that expansion included 12 new characters. And you only use six uh, during a two to four player game, so you could make a lot of uh, combinations to, uh, to play the game uh, with. So now this year we have uh, Redis Africanus, and the first thing that Redis Africanus adds is, uh, is a new board with uh, North Africa and uh, material to uh, play the game with uh, five or six players. And uh, in a five or six player game, uh, you also use two more uh, character cards. So when you play it with uh, two, three or four players, you use six characters. When you play it with uh, five or six players, you, you always use uh, eight characters. There's also a new uh, 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 class uh, symbol, the, uh, the Islam uh, uh, symbol. And um, so, so now you can play the game with five or six players. And what um, um, Redis Africanus also adds is uh, a little more, uh, a little bit more tactical uh, uh, possibilities. Uh, for example, the uh, region cards. There are region cards included in the game uh, now, and you can use those region cards to defend your cubes. For example, when uh, I have to move a cube here because I had the, uh, the church symbol. Um, I can play this card 
and I can keep this queue on the board if I want to. So that's the first function of uh, these cards. And you always start the game with uh, three cards. With a, a question mark, you can uh, uh, you can choose the uh, uh, the symbol for which you want uh, to ask protection. The second thing that these cards do is uh, there are uh, regions uh, mentioned on those cards, and um, if you uh, have the majority of cubes in that region at the end of the game, then you get also get one point. So. If I have uh, a majority of cubes in a Tartaria at the end of the game, I will score one extra point. And in this game, mostly scores vary between uh, 13, 14, 15, 16. So one point, or two, or even three, can really make uh, a big difference. So with those region, uh, region cards, you will start focusing more on specific, uh, specific regions to get a majority uh, over there. So those region cards, they add a little more, uh, 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 a little more tactics. And uh, besides that, there are also, like I said, there's a new uh, class symbol, and uh, it also comes with four new uh, class cards. And um, uh, this one, for example, it marks the introduction of the caravan. And <laughs> you have this nice uh, camel uh, piece over it. here. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, when you have this card in front of you, then you may uh, move uh, the camel two uh, regions and if you uh, have a majority everyone. Oh yeah, everyone who has the majority in, in in those regions may add one cube extra on the board besides the fact that you already that you also may place as many cubes in a region as our red tokens so this is a very uh, uh, nice and special and uh, powerful card um, with this one for example this is also a new one you may draw three region cards you look at the regions, you keep one, uh, you place a cube in that region, and then you discard all three. So that's what this card uh, does, for example. Oh. Yeah, okay. Um, well, there are two more, uh, two more uh, cards, and I would recommend people to uh, uh, just try it. Uh, 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 try the new cards, uh, see how they, uh, uh, how they uh, interact with each other. Um, uh, until uh, today, there have been uh, released 32 different cards for uh, for Redis, so including all expansions and bonus cards, etc. So now you can uh, uh, make uh, over 600 million uh, of, co uh, of uh, uh, combinations. different combinations to play the game with. And if you want to try them all, you uh, it, it, it will cost you only uh, 500 million hours of your life. Oh, that's not a lot. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, awesome. Thank you guys again so much yeah, okay. for you, showing us another one. Okay. And I got to say, you guys are a great team. <laughs> <laughs> you guys have it down. <laughs>